Hi everyone, welcome to today's episode. I am your Kente teacher. In this episode, I'm going to take you through the normal routine that I go through whenever a Kente clothes order is placed by a client or a customer. So the picture you see is the picture she sent to me to place the order, wanting four years of this design for her wedding or traditional wedding ceremony quickly i have to prepare my wap which i'm doing right now so in this four years of kente cloth we have 16 individual kente strips in this four years kente cloth that order that she placed so i have to prepare the wap that can get me 16 pieces of individual kente strips so as to make up for the four years kente cloth that she ordered so that is a preparation of the warp ongoing so right after the preparation of the warp the warp need to be fixed into the pair of headers that is the designing headers, the pair of uh, plain headers, then the beta. So as you can see, that is the fixing of the warp yarns into the pair of headers. So the front one or the dark one is the designing header, whilst the green or the lemon green is the plain header so i have to fix the warp into the two pairs of headers then right after that it is fixed into the beta then weaving begins as at this stage i've already done the spinning of my weft yarns those that i'll be using for the design are called the weft yarns and those you saw me laying on the ground or during the preparation of the warp are known as the warp or preparation of the warp yeah so the weaving begins immediately after fixing of the warp into the beta and spinning of the web yarns so that is it that is the design she sent to me as you saw in the picture earlier on that is exactly what i'm weaving and it must not look different because that wasn't or if if it looks different it is not what she sent to you or he sent to you or the client sent to you so that is going to be problematic so it must look exactly as she sent to you or as the order she placed so that is it a moment and this 16 pieces or this four years of Kinte cloth that she ordered is going to take me about three weeks to finish. And as you can see the design, this is a three shuttle Kinte design. This is a three shuttle Kinte design. That's a one, two, and three. So it's going to take me quite some time to get it done for her so it's a three shuttle kente design so 16 pieces or 16 female kente clothes will make up for the four years kente clothes that she ordered for her traditional wedding so that is it i'm on it And like I said, it's going to take me three weeks to get it done for her. So this is the design she sent to me. And the design has a border. The design has what we call a border. Remember in the previous episode, I told you about the border and then the design. So this is the border. So I 
told you in the previous episode that the various parts of a kente strip a single kente strip has parts so it has it must has a border a design and then a border again so what we saw earlier on was the design and this is the border of the order or the kinky cloth she ordered to be done for her so the selection of the colors and everything was done by the client so she sent me the colors to use and that is how we do it unless maybe the person doesn't have any idea of colors then i will have to give uh, some series of uh, designs that i have on my phone uh, i have to send those pictures to her to make a choice but if she already has one or she has already made any choice of her own then she will have to send it to you like she sent this to me that we saw in the earlier picture so that is it i'm on it and it's going to take me three weeks to finish the 16 individual kinky strips that will make up for the four years kinky clothes that she ordered and remember i told you she lays a female kinky cloth order and a single female kinky cloth is going to take a length of 183 centimeters and that is what i'm doing now that is what i'm doing now we also have a shop where we buy all these yarns yeah so whenever an order arrives we go to the shop to buy the yarns and then if they are colors like i said it took me three weeks to get a job done for her it took me three weeks to get the job done for her so today i just decided to take you through the normal routine that i go through when a client places a kente cloth order for a traditional wedding it could be anniversary it could be graduation it could be festivals celebrations ceremonies and a whole lot so i by this time i think i was able to um, get 14 pieces down so i think this was the last day which i managed to get or to cut two strips to make up for the 16 pieces that will take care or that will be up or make up for the four years in the clothes that she ordered yeah So I was able to cut the final two trips on this day. So yeah, and that was how this was the final day. So I managed to cut two strips. That's the first one. Uh, when it's up to the length you want, which is the 183, you create a space like the one you are seeing now, where that length is cut off then the second one too is removed from the ruler so that's the first one and this is the second one actually this was the final day so this is the 15th and then the 16th kente individual kente strips so from here i'll be heading to my tailor in a a nearby town called Akusumbu, the eastern regional part of Ghana. So
so I have a special tailor who does the joining for me and then from here I was going to him yeah so I'm about to set off for that journey it's not quite far from here I am in Joapo so just set up for Akosoko it's not quite far from Joapo it's located in the Volta in the Volta or the these two towns are found between Volta and Eastern they are so close so I'm still on my journey to see my tailor so that he can get the strips joined for me to make or form the cloth. So that is a beautiful Adami bridge at a town called Atinkuti. So this is my normal route that I always um, pass through. I always travel to my tailor to get the Tinko strips joined for me. So this is my usual route that I, I always go through. So I'll be with my tailor in uh, a few minutes. Then she will, he will get the strips joined for me. Then he will make them ready for packaging. Then I'll get back to the shop where I will prepare it for delivery. So this is the entry to the Akosombo Township. This is the main gate or the main entry to the Akosombo Township where my tailor is located. So I'm going to him to get the 16 Kinte strips joined together for me. So he's in the market, around the market here. I finally arrived and then the joining process is just about to start so he's the only one who does it very well for me so I always take the, 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 the risk to travel to him since it is not that um, a long or a far distance so I just travel to him and then get the kente strips joined and then prepare it for me prepare it for me for packaging and all that then I package it and then send it back to the shop and then finally transport it or deliver it to the client who placed the order so she's going to use this for a traditional wedding so those were the colors she chose and i've just done justice to it by weaving it all and now the, the joining process is going on so it is the individual kinte strips that are joined together to make the clothes so he has to arrange them in a special way so as to get the actual design to make it look like exactly like the picture the client sent to order the Lot. so that needs to be taken into consideration and he does that carefully and correctly so as you can see he's joining it or he's joining them together
is joining them together. So like I said earlier on, it took me three weeks to get this job done for her. So four years of this design. And the design is a three shuttle kinte design with a border that has a royal stool design in it. So the joining process is still ongoing. The joining process is still ongoing. As you can see, he's carefully doing the joining. And trust me, as you say it this way, as it's been joined this way, it's very, very durable and it is difficult to tear unless you use a sharp object to cut it off it won't tear it won't just tear i mean the the the, the, the two sides that are joined together becomes very firm durable and very strong so this is how the kinte cloth is joined and this is the normal routine that i go through whenever a client places a kinte cloth order so your orders are welcome i will do justice to that I'll weave them nicely for you joined nicely package and then will be delivered to you wherever you are across the world so your orders are also welcome as well as um, showing you the low house behind the kente clothes that we have in Ghana. So the joining is still ongoing. The joining process is still ongoing. The joining process of the individual kente strips is still ongoing. So this is a female kente cloth. For that matter, the length is 183 centimeters. That is the length. And that is also equivalent to two yards. Yeah, it's equivalent to two yards. And the client wants four yards. So, eight individual kente strips, when joined together, will give us two years. So, the 16 is going to give us four years. That is why, or that's how come I have to weave 16 pieces. 16 strips so the first eight that will be joined will give us two years can take lot two years of can take lot and then there's the, the the second eight strips will also give us two years so two years plus two years will be equal to the four years order that the client has placed So that is a joining happening there with my tailor in Akusumbu, the eastern region 
part of the eastern region of Ghana. So, as you can see, the cloth is very thick and heavy. And if you want to know the quality of any kente cloth, it is its heavy nature and thickness. It is the heavy nature of the cloth and its thickness that shows or that tells it whether it is quality, a quality kente cloth or not. And as you can observe in this joining process, you could see that it's looking very thick and very heavy. So right after joining them, They have to be folded nicely, take it back to the shop and then package it or package them nicely and prepare them for delivery to the customer who places the order. So, right after joining, I'll take it back to the shop. So, the first two yards is done. So the second one is also done. As you can see, it's looking very heavy and very beautiful. So, is the first two years two yards of kente cloth and then the other two years is here also two yards so two years plus two years gives us four years now i'm going to take it back to the shop Hold it nicely, package it, and then prepare it for delivery to the customer who placed the order. So, first two years, and then the second two years. So, so two years plus another two years gives us four years which completes the work now let's get back to the shop so there are other designs that are for sale at the shop and then this is the just the current one that i'm coming to package for the client so there are other designs at the shop that are awaiting delivery 